Hello, my friends. Welcome back to Law Creations. Uh, forgive my voice. I'm getting sick, unfortunately. Uh, but I'll try to get through this video without us uh, sounding too bad. But this is my finished diorama. I apologize for not making a video this week. But uh, I've been very busy with, uh, you know, revamping and organizing my room, my studio. I uh, don't have a very big area to work, so it definitely needed some attention. So I ended up repainting all the walls. I ended up, you know, building some display shelves, painting those. And that's just to give you a little idea of, of what I did. I really like the top corner there. That's where I'm displaying a lot of my Punisher work. And some NECA figures, just some Marvel Universe. You'll see it as I do videos. But the main purpose of this is to show you my... Uh, my finished diorama that I just completed painting. I took some time to actually paint it and relax. But uh, it's for my acid rain figure. So I wanted to give it that burnt uh, kind of look to go along with uh, the figure's color scheme. So that's what I went with. And uh, I think it came out pretty good. I achieved kind of what I wanted. And uh, I got some balsa wood in there. All the bricks were cut piece by piece and then laid laid in place. And then that was just cut out with a knife and just uh, just a whole bunch of texture and ruins. But uh, just to give you a closer look of everything. I really dirtied up the uh, the ground and made it look uh, sandy and, and just uh, dirty. But to give you an idea of uh, the carv work and, you know, the dry brushing that that's the reason why you want to get nice little edges like that so you can dry brush it and and highlight it and bring out the uh bring out the texture and everything and that's what i did with the wood as well you know see the highlight on the the side of the wood and the brick and you can see it as you go all the way around to give you a closer look but that's just uh just just things you learn as you go along and you know, you just highlight and uh, capture the raised areas. Kind of, that's a good example right there. But just an up close look. It's for uh, it's for my acid rain figure. You can put one to two pieces of uh, 118 scale figures on there, and I think it came out pretty good. But uh, this one's uh, for me to keep. It's for uh, my my display. Maybe I'll start doing a tutorial on how I did this and made it. Because uh, it is rather easy and uh, you guys can do it uh, rather easily. And uh, just to show you how I did it, maybe we'll do that. Okay, guys, let me know what you think if you'd like to see something like that. Uh, let me know what you want for my channel, what you're interested in. Custom action figures, dioramas, reviews. Um, I'm here to please. I want you guys to be uh, to come to the channel and uh, and just enjoy yourselves and escape for a little bit. Okay? All right, guys, this is uh, my finished diorama for my acid rain figure. Thanks a lot for checking things out, and uh, have a good rest of your day.